With our extreme weekend weather, thousands of lightning strikes caused power outages and small brush fires. Events ended early and tonight even a church is thanking God that it survived. New tonight, ABC 10's guard Paul Sunka reports from Modesto where a Baptist church is assessing damage. Wherever you look, the signs of just how powerful the thunderstorm was are obvious. It was a little weird. It was just random. Random, not because it happened. But where? And I look out my window and I see it right there. <laughs> Lightning struck a roof belonging to Modesto's Christian Love Baptist Church. It was nerve-wracking. Saturday evening, neighbors walked onto their front steps to document the downpour. And then this. Oh. The power just went out. And I dropped the kids off and received a call saying that our church had been struck by lightning. Charles Jenneret is an associate minister at the church, but at the time of the call, he was working as a bus driver for the Turlock Unified School District. Two things struck my mind. One was wow, and the next was thank God for the fact that if the lightning was strong enough to put a hole in it, and yet it didn't catch on fire. Other than the exterior damage that you see, church leaders say they had to shut down one of their AC units because it's making a lot more noise after the lightning strike, but the total damage still remains unknown. So to have lightning strike this particular building and still be standing, I consider that a blessing from God himself. Generet says the message the church is taking away from this is to do more humanitarian work, an act of God. This Modesto church is counting its blessings. Wow, the power returned early this morning and the church held its regular Sunday service. Inspectors will be there tomorrow to assess the building for damage.